everybody, it's Paula from Crafting by the Pond. I hope you're having a fabulous day. Um, I am on today with a Timu haul. Um, sorry I've been gone so long. I had the COVID and I was not feeling well at all. So I'm just now kind of um, uh, doing catching up on some videos and doing um, some hauls of some things that I picked up um, that have been sitting here <laughs> because... I was not well, but anyway, so um, I, I'm going to post um, an affiliate link down below if you're interested, um, and there'll also be a coupon code that you can um, utilize should you um, place an order for the first time, and just, you know, check it out. I'd appreciate it. Um, so anyway, let's get on with it, shall we? Again, this is a, tum a Timu haul. It's, you know, I, stuff I bought my own money, so... Um, the first thing I picked up was this, uh, the mini sealer. Um, a lot of people have been picking this up. This is great, um, for like when you do happy mail, um, you can seal your envelopes, um, it has a magnet on it. It's supposed to, you know, most people use it in their kitchen just to kind of like seal a bag. So, um, I have not tried it yet, um, but I'll let you know, okay? Um, the next thing that I picked up was one of these um, pocket, um, like a utility knife, and it's, you know, pen, but it's, you know, a blade. Let's take a look, see if we got some. Um, I don't want to cut on my thing. <laughs> But we'll try. Let's see how sharp is this bad boy. Ooh, pretty good. Look at that. It's pretty good, guys. All right, perfect. This is perfect um, for uh, fussy cutting and trying to, you know, cut out, you know, small items. I picked this up because I saw Gina. Gina loves to craft. Um, picked it up. So, you know, monkey see, monkey do, Gina. Hope you're doing okay. Um, oh, Hi, Mom. Hi, Pop. Hi, Bubs. Hi, Dottie. Hi, Frotter. Hey, everybody. Hope everybody's doing okay. Um, now back to the show. Okay. <laughs> so I picked these um, these up because I'm going to be starting my Alice in Wonderland journal. And these little pins are great. Um, and I think I got, I don't even know how many are in here, like 100 or something. Um, but these are great just to kind of put on the page. So I picked those up. Um, and then I picked up, these are like glue dots. So um, they're double sided. I liked them because it has like this little tab on there. So I mean, you need to pull it off, right? This is sticky. And then it has like the little Okay, if I can do it. Sorry, <laughs> my coordination is so. I'm just, I'm still, guys, suffering. Um, and then you just kind of pull this off, and then you have like your your glue dot. So I don't want to pull it off because I want to use it. But anyway, um, these are really cheap. I, I'll link. I'll try to link what I can down below because somebody, listen, if you're going to come on here and you're going to leave nasty stuff about, well, hey, I watched your Timu and it was just like all craft stuff. Um, it's a craft channel, Einstein. Um, so if you're going to write mean stuff on my channel, I'm just going to delete your comment. So like whatever, have the day you deserve. Um, so <laughs> anyway, rant over. <laughs> Sorry. I'm usually not ugly, but I just, you know, I was just like, really? Okay, fine. Okay, fine. All right, so this is a small little book, and it's flowers in clusters, and it's vellum. And again, this is really, really cute. It's going to be perfect, um, you know, for junk journals. So I picked that up. Um, yeah, really, really cute. And then... This, I've been excited about these. These are vellum sticky notes. So how cool is that? So those will be great uh, for the junk journal as well. Um, okay, 
Mad Tea Party. These are Alice in Wonderland inspired stickers. I will link these below. These things are a hot commodity and they were like selling out, selling out, selling out. So I had them email me. You know, you can do an option where you ask them to like let you know when a product comes back. And as soon as it popped back up, I ordered two of them. So there's just some quotes um, from Alice in Wonderland that are going to be perfect. Um, some of them are just like they're different. Um, like that's everything right there. That's great for the vintage. Um, this one, I didn't really understand that one. But, you know, it's cute. They're really, really cute. I love that. <laughs> The Cheshire Cat, um, and then the Rabbit, and the Mad Hatter. Um, they're good. I mean, I really, really liked it. So um, I picked up two of them because I thought they'll get used in that book for sure in my journal, which I have like a bin put aside of everything that I'm going to be using um, in the actual journal. This one is cool. Advice from a caterpillar. But I wish they would have had a caterpillar in here, but they didn't. Um, so yeah, I picked up two of those, like I said, because I saw them and like they're not staying on the website at all. Like they get them in and they go right back out. So picked up two of those. Um, the next thing I picked up another one, and it's it's. I thought I ordered the Alice in Wonderland one, but I did not. I guess I ordered it wrong, but that's okay. We'll use this. I just don't really like it that much. I may, you know, so there's paper, and then this one is vellum of the same print. You know, I'm not about that, whatever that is. Um, and it's more steampunk, and you get like a printed page and then the vellum. So, I mean, that in itself is kind of cool, but I just, these, I, I don't know. I may tell them that they sent me the wrong thing because it's not, I, I don't see me, like, using this. I mean, it's the, kind of like the steampunk theme, and that's not really my favorite kind of genre. So, I don't know. This might be a keep to the side. I don't know. Dot, if you want it, let me know, Dottie. Um, it's yours. Um, and so then this other one I picked up is the Small Talk. Small Talk stickers. And it just has a bunch of different um, things on there. Okay. Um, you know, so there's like some New Year's. Um, I like it because all of the, you know, the, the pages are different, um, and it's in black and in white, so, I mean, this was like wicked cheap, it wasn't very expensive at all, so it's definitely going to come in handy. Um, the next thing I picked up were these bags, these are like, I mean, things are cute. Um, so these, um, great for Happy Mail. They've got pretty roses on them. I thought those were cute. And then they got the ceiling bags on there. I need to get back into doing the Happy Mail. Because I like getting it. And I like putting Happy Mail together, too. I just, I haven't been doing it. Okay, so then I picked up this cute little bag. Sorry about the crinkling. I know a lot of people don't like it. Um... And it says, you know, it's from Alice in Wonderland, and it says you're entirely bonkers, but I'll tell you a secret, all the best people are, and if that's not the truth, I don't know what is. So this was perfect. Love it, love it, love it. Um, this next thing that I picked up, it was a stamp set. Let me just get some white cardstock out of here. So you guys will be able to see it. And nothing is ever simple when you sign it. It wouldn't be a video for me, for me if it wasn't like unorganized and weird. Okay, so, alright. So this is a cute little, 
you know, you guys, you know, when you watch me, you know, you know, mice and rabbits. <laughs> I'm, I'm for it all day long. Um, and I thought I had... Oh, let me open this. Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm still, like, not right. I had COVID, and it, it just... Ah, that was horrible. Um, okay. So, here's the, the stamp set itself. It's got the cute little mice on there, the mushrooms, um, and the little sentiments. So, that was really cute. And this was, like, really cheap. It was, like, $2.00. So that was a good find. Um, and then, but wait, there's more. They sent me, um, I think I'm like still having trouble thinking, guys. Thought process is totally not there. Um, so then I picked up the Eiffel Tower um, dies. I thought that was really, really pretty. I have no idea what this says. <laughs> There's like a some words on there. I'm going to have to cut it out to see what it says. But I thought that was really cute for my in one of a journal. Okay, so guys, I wanted to let you know that if you have an issue with anything that you get from Timu um, and there's a problem, you can do like a return. Um, sometimes they want you to send the product back. Otherwise, they're just like, you know what, we'll just refund your money and just, you can like keep it, re-gift it, you know, gift it or, you know, recycle it. Um, so I picked up like these, uh, this stamp set, okay? Well, I ordered the stamp set in English and it looks like this is French. So I... You know, I reached out to them and I'm like, hey, um, I ordered the set in English and you sent me the French version. Um, and they gave me my money back and told me to keep it. But I mean, I, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Um, anyhow, way. But I really thought, you know, this has the matching, um, this, uh, the, the dies go with the stamp set. So. Um, I may have to go back on and order the English one since they gave me credit for it. All right, so this next one is, I don't really remember what this one is, but um, it's like a frame die, and it's really, really pretty. Um, and I really like the scallop on the side that's separate. Um, but... I thought this was really, really nice. I wanted it for the Alice in Wonderland journal. So I picked that one up. And then this one is gorgeous. And it was not very expensive at all, you guys. It was like $3. I was like, what? It was giving me Anna Griffin vibes, so I picked it up. Um, but how pretty is that? How that's just going to look gorgeous in... Um, in a journal that's going to look stunning. So I picked that up. Okay, um, and then I picked up these Christmas stamps. Um, I thought that those were cute. Um, just the three little images there. I thought that was cute for a quick card for Christmas. And then I picked up some Alice in Wonderland paper. This, it looks like the same stuff um, from Stamperia. So, um, and it's not, it's pretty decent. The thing of it is, is it was a little, I think I'm going to have to iron it because it got a little banged up um, in transit. Um, but it's single-sided and it's just, it's pretty heavy paper. I don't, the GSM on it is probably... Um, it's not very good. It's a little heavier than copier paper, but not by much. But I thought the images would, were perfect um, to go in the Alice in Wonderland journal. And this one says Alice's Adventures in Wonderland. So I picked that one up. Picked this up. This was great. This was a great little find, I think. And then, you know, the rabbit. 
and just like some journaling spots. Um, this I love with the cat. I love that. And then some of the storyline there. Uh, just some more journaling spots. Um, and then another... I mean, these are going to be just great. I mean, it's... I think it's... I don't even know... It's not... It, it's. I think it's like 8 by 8 to be honest with you. Um, and then just some vintage images of what I wanted. This is like a dupe, I think, of that Stampera paper. Um, which is fine because, I mean, I have that paper also, but that stuff was not cheap, you guys. <laughs> that paper pack was a lot of money. And there's some different images on here. This was a home run, this, this paper. I really, really think it was. And then the hearts. And then just the cards. So, um, that is my little Timu haul um, that I picked up a couple weeks ago. It's like been sitting here with the rest of my life. <laughs> um, so, um, anyway, I will post um, a link for Timu with the affiliate, affiliate link um, if you're so interested. And I hope you guys have a great day. Oh, be sweet and be kind to each other. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.